Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to my first video of 2024. Happy New Year everyone. Is it still okay to say Happy New Year? I feel like we're a bit past that now, but Happy New Year anyway, I haven't said it yet. I am so excited to be back on YouTube. Thank you for bearing with me while I took a little break over Christmas. I had a lovely Christmas. It was fantastic to celebrate with my family and just relax. I carried on posting over on Instagram because uh, I find that a bit easier but I didn't obviously post on YouTube because it's a lot more time consuming and I didn't really have anything to film. I was just in my pyjamas lounging around most days going on walks so it would have been fairly boring if I'd have vlogged. But I am back with a little cosy haul. So this is kind of like a what I got for Christmas but I realised that most of these things are all kind of cosy, homey things. So I thought I'd put them in more of like a new in haul or a what's new video rather than a what I got for Christmas. I know some of you did request a what I got for Christmas when I posted my what I got for my birthday, but I don't want this to come across as bragging. I don't want you to watch this video and think I'm showing off and saying, oh, look at all these wonderful presents I got for Christmas. That's not the case. So I'm gonna make it more into a haul video, maybe give you guys a little bit of January inspiration because January is the month where I just wanna be cozy at home. I've done all the like party season, all the going out, and I just like to settle in at home, reset, relax, take it easy, and all of these things kind of apply to that. So the first thing that I'm gonna show you guys is something that my mum got me, and this is one of my favorite Christmas presents. It's basically a foot warmer. Now I am constantly complaining about having cold feet, and not just cold feet, but cold to the point where it's actually sometimes quite painful, and I'll have to just sit with my feet in front of the fire for like 10 minutes to warm them up, or I have to get up and like walk around, get the blood flow going again. I must have terrible circulation in my feet. So my mum bought me this foot warmer it's from marks and spencers and obviously you just put your feet in here and my goodness it makes such a difference it's like having them under the duvet it's amazing so i just sit in the evening on the sofa and put my feet in here sometimes with my socks and my slippers on as well if i'm feeling extra cold but i couldn't be without this now i've used it every single day since my mum got it for me and I just love it and it fits kind of with the interior in her lounge but yeah from Marks and Spencers and an amazing present if you know somebody like me who has cold feet or you have cold feet amazing another thing my mum got me to combat the cold feet issue is these Ugg socks which I love she actually got me some Ugg socks for Christmas last year but these ones are so cozy they are fully fleece lined and my goodness, they're warmer than my Ugg slippers. They are so nice. I mean, they make my feet look very strange when I wear them because they're so thick, but these worn with the foot warmer, heaven. When my mum gave these to me, she did say I didn't love the colour, but there wasn't much choice. I think they only came in this purpley colour and maybe a pink, I'm not sure, but I don't care. As long as my feet are warm, I'm very happy. I also recently got these fluffy socks from Arquette, which I'm yet to wear because they just look so nice, I don't want to ruin them. They're kind of like that fuzzy material, really gorgeous colour, just such a nice material. These were £22, so quite pricey for socks, especially socks that aren't cashmere, but they're so soft and they just look really cute and fuzzy. So I didn't even know Arquette really did socks, but these ones are lovely. So I will have to pluck up the courage to wear them soon. I'm sure they're going to keep my feet warm as well. And finally, to keep my feet warm, I had to have a new pair of Ugg slippers for Christmas because let me show you the state of my old ones. If you've watched my vlog, you will have seen me traipse around the house in these disgusting slippers. I've had these for two years. I wear them every single day and they are just rooted. These were once the chestnut ones, which like I said, I got two years ago, but it was definitely time for an upgrade. So I went for a different color and I picked these ones, which are a beautiful color. They are the shade Walnut, and they're a really nice kind of like mink, greyish kind of color, which I love. And they have the gold Ugg on the side, as opposed to these ones, which just had it written on. Oh my God, look at the comparison. <laughs> I'm still wearing my old ones occasionally around the house because I just want to keep these so nice. This sheepskin fur really does flatten down as soon as you start to wear them, so I just want to keep it all poofy so my feet stay nice and toasty, but 
I thought these were really nice, a little bit different. I haven't seen too many of these around, so I thought it'd be nice to change it up. I normally go for the chestnuts, so something a little bit different. All this is making me want to do is put my dressing gown on, all of those socks on, my slippers, my foot warmer, and just sit on the sofa and watch Harry Potter. Another cute and cosy thing that my mum got me for Christmas, these super sweet earmuffs. These were from HomeSense, I think and a really gorgeous like cream colour, so nice and soft and I thought these would be perfect for my skiing holiday so I'm going to take these skiing with me and I just thought they're so cute. They're also great for dog walking because I do get particularly cold ears, I get cold everything apparently and like when it's really windy and stuff, earmuffs on to protect your ears. I also got a couple of beauty items recently, these are just top ups of products I already know I love, I got this lip liner from Rimmel and it is in the shade Tiramisu, if I just swatch it there for you, you can see. It's a really lovely nude colour, I think it's the perfect nude lip liner and super affordable as well so I got another one of those and then I got my trusty Elemis cleansing balm, I love that it comes with a little washcloth as well. Yeah I love this, I've used the rose one as well which is equally as nice but sometimes the plain one is all you need. I'd recently run out of this just before Christmas so it's great to have a top up. It's my favourite cleansing balm ever. I cannot be without this now. If you haven't tried it, try it and you'll never look back. Now whilst we're on the subject of being all relaxed and cosy at home, another thing I love to do is take a nice long relaxing bath. I'm definitely a bath person over a shower. If I could I'd have a bath every day but I end up spending hours in there so it just wouldn't work. But my mum got me a very special gift from Jo Malone. This is a bath oil. So this is the pomegranate noir one and I've used this perfume before so I know I love the scent but it's just a bath oil that you pour in the bath. I've had one of these before, I can't remember what scent it was but I've had one of these before and it makes the whole bathroom smell. It's so relaxing, it's just a lovely like added touch to your bath so if you are a bath person like me and you like to romanticise them this is such a lovely product to add. I haven't used it yet so I'm very excited to try it in my next bath and I love the pomegranate noir scent. It's one of my favourite Jo Malone scents. I definitely need to get myself a refill of the fragrance because I adore it. It's so good for this time of year as well. And then next up I have some clothes. So this loungewear set is something that I have been wearing so much, especially in between Christmas and New Year. It is from Marks and Spencers. I actually wore it yesterday so if it looks a bit worn, that's why. It's from Marks and Spencers, it's from the Rosie Huntington Whiteley collection and it's this beautiful like soft fleecy material. These are the trousers, elasticated waist, two pockets at the back, really nice like straight leg, loose fitting trouser and then to go with a lovely v-neck jumper. This loungewear set actually went into the sale so I'm hoping it's still available in some sizes. It is as I'm filming this video but hopefully it will be by the time the video goes live. I got the top in a medium and the trousers in a small both fit really really nicely. It's just so nice to have lovely cosy soft loungewear. You could definitely wear this out as well with some trainers and like a long wool coat but I have just been living in it for around the house. So soft and cosy. I've never got anything from that range before. I had a rosy dressing gown a couple of years ago before I had my Soho Home one which I loved because they were nice and like soft and oversized much like my Soho Home one is now but I've never had any of the underwear or loungewear from a rosy collection but that I love. So whilst we're in the mindset that January is for relaxing, it is also for nice long walks. So my mum got me this shuffle from Holland Cooper for Christmas and it's another thing I've not stopped using. I did ask for a shuffle for Christmas as one of my presents because I've wanted one for a long time. I thought it would look fab underneath my barber coat. It's a similar khaki green colour and this one is just gorgeous. I love the tan leather lining. It also has a really nice tan leather detail at the back and then it has Holland Cooper around the collar. It's just 
a really lovely piece if you are into your countryside walks and you spend a lot of time outdoors like I do this is perfect I've worn it so much it looks amazing with leggings like I said with my barber with any kind of puffer coat over the top and it will also be really good for the spring to wear as like a lighter layer so I'm very very happy with this I think it also comes in a navy color and maybe lighter color as well or a black I'm not sure but I just loved the khaki and yeah another thing that I have not stopped wearing a slightly different present and something that I never really thought that I would have asked for for Christmas before but I'm so happy with this so over Christmas and New Year I wasn't really exercising and I wasn't wearing my Apple watch I recently got my other watch back from a repair so I was wearing that every day and I didn't really touch this one now it's January this is back on my wrist and it's still got this ugly black strap that it came with so I ordered myself I've just unbox this now I ordered myself a nice bracelet to wear instead of this ugly black strap I just got this from Amazon and it's like a two-toned gold and silver bracelet actually very similar to the bracelet on my other watch and this was only 15 pound I think so really affordable I'm gonna work out how to switch over the strap in a minute and I probably will have to take some links out of this I imagine because I have quite a small wrist so that is my project for this afternoon but I'm excited to put this on and jazz up my Apple watch a little bit because you guys know I've been complaining about this since I bought it about two years ago so to have it looking a little bit nicer will be good and finally my main present that I got for Christmas which I was so shocked about I really didn't think I was going to get these I'd mentioned in passing that I liked them and I wanted them but never for a second did I think my mum would actually be listening first of all and then actually go and buy them so I am so happy with these so I got a pair of the airpod maxes these are obviously in the silver color come with a beautiful case I will get them out and show you but I'm just so excited to have these I have my little airpods as well which are great for traveling but when I'm going on slightly longer journeys or plane journeys these are going to be incredible I'm going to use them at home as well for my editing I just love them I'm going to pop them on so you guys can see them on but they're just amazing absolutely amazing I'm obsessed with them Eek! they are so good as well I don't know if I'm shouting right now because I can't hear much but they are so good as well I tested the sound quality they are amazing so I'm so excited to get using them and to edit with them and just wear them around my neck like I'm a DJ so that is everything from my cozy January haul and a few of my Christmas presents as well I really hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope you had a wonderful Christmas and New Year. If you have any video suggestions for me, I have a few already planned for January, but if you have anything that you would like to see, then make sure to let me know in the comments. If you did enjoy this video, it would be fantastic if you could give it a little like. If you are new to my channel, I would absolutely love it if you hit the subscribe button and I will see you all very soon in my next video. Bye.